Samuel's in again, the right back into Dixon. Samuel, oh, it was almost perfect for Manchester City. Kirsch pouncing, but great play by Lakar Samuel, the right back. Lovely link-up play between he and William Dixon. The see none of that cut and thrust that we saw way too severe last week. Mane, it's a good ball by Mane. Bamba could be in behind here for Dortmund. Oh, it's a horrible finish. Well, it's the first time, really, that either defence has been cut open. and Samuel Bamba unable to hit the target. It's a lovely ball from Farrakou Cisse. Free kick for Manchester City in a really useful position. Floated in and the header straight at Kirsch. In uh, 2018, that ended in loss to Barcelona. They're in behind here now, Manchester City with Bob. Great work from the Norwegian youngster. Semic. Good touch by Semic to Rykov. Now Anning. Makes space for the shot and forces the save from Van Sass. Good drop of the shoulder just to make the space. Now Charles steps away from Rykov. Plays it in. Great chance here for Manchester City. And not taken by Nico O'Reilly. Well, he seemed to take an age to get the shot away. Good work from Bob and then by Charles. And then he's in here. Hit it now, surely. It took that extra touch, allowed Collins to make life difficult and for Kirsch to readjust. Now Brunner. This is Simic back to Brunner. It was neat football. Brunner again. And he's blazed it over. Coming more and more into this game, the German side as it goes on. First one blocked by Taylor. Oh, the header behind is an awkward one. And Taylor kept his call brilliantly there. Mane. Almost caught in possession. It's fallen here for Dixon. Back with Bob. Dixon out to Mabudi. Who goes for goal, and it wasn't too bad an effort. Dedere Mabudi. And now Borges. Good touch back from Borges. And that is the opening goal from Nico O'Reilly. It is Manchester City who get the breakthrough. On 33 minutes here, into the corner. Good work from Carlos Borges, who City have been struggling to get into this game. But Leon Semic on that occasion missing the ball, and Borges with the awareness and the ability just to cut it back for Nico O'Reilly. Taken short, here's Bob with the back heel towards O'Reilly. And the shot straight at Kirsch in the end. Samuel. Cissé. Strong challenge from Burns. And the free kick goes to Dortmund. And I thought Burns had every right to go for that. He's got the yellow card. 50-50 challenge gets the ball, Burns. Behind Galvez to Bamba. Good run by Bamba, still going. Goal kick in the end. Just that final product, Samuel Bamba looks really lively for Dortmund. And Semic to Simic. There is a substitute, Simic. And it's straight at the goalkeeper, Van Sass. For the substitute, Noah Gabriel Simic. And the chase is on here. And Borges getting in behind and just can't finish it off. Portuguese speedster Carlos Borges was in behind. Deft a touch there, and that would have been 2 0. Nothing Collins could do once Borges was goal side. 
Leon Semic. Faced by Galvez. Semic with the touch back to Simic. Semic again. They're appealing for offside. He gets the shot away. And Van Sass makes the save. No real power in the shot from Leon Semic. He's well offside. Bounce gets the better of Taylor. Here's Rykov. Brunner in support. Here is Brunner who hits it first time, but into the side netting. Kept his position well. Forced Brunner wide. Spraying the ball out to Valtz. Helped it on well to Semic, who made something of it. Simic in support. He decided to go alone here, Semic. He did, and it's tipped away by Van Sass. Versatile defender as well. Happy as part of a back three. An orthodox right back or indeed a right wing back. Cisse. Better away by Taylor. It fell kindly for the shot. And driven over the top. It's uh, another half chance though for Borussia Dortmund. Still, they await their first goal in this season's UEFA Youth League. And they've worked hard in this game. They've played quite well, Dortmund. Just those finishing touches. Simic. A wonderful equaliser for Borussia Dortmund. Vasco Valtz. And this time, Dortmund deserved that. And it's Manchester on his face. That doesn't bode particularly well. Needs to keep his cool here, though, Rykov. And he does, straight down the middle from the young Dutchman. And it's Manchester City 1, Borussia Dortmund 2. And the German side have turned this game on its head in the second half with two goals. Well, they may have scored five on their opening day trip to Sevilla. But they have got work to do now to get something out of this game, Manchester City. They led at half-time. Bob. Adam, he's here for Andala. Can he get the shot away? Oh, it's a penalty. Poor challenge from Anning. Oh, lunges in, and I think he and his teammates knew. And tucks it away. It is 2-2. And Manchester City may well have saved themselves a point here. Dortmund to lead and City to level. It's a cool penalty from the young Norwegian midfielder. Taylor picking out Borges. Stands the cross up in there. Oh, it's almost a gift. And it's in. And Dala for Manchester City. Two goals right at the end of the game. And Manchester City are going to take all three points. But his side have got themselves out of jail here. Cross in from Borges, and Dala couldn't finish there. And I think it was over the line before Anning touched it in. Well, what an impact he's had. Joel and Dala, the substitute. Well, after three successive group stage exits, Manchester City now really looking good. To make it beyond the group stage because they have beaten Dortmund here by three goals to two, and two or three of those in yellow collapse to the grass in frustration. They were a minute or so away from a notable victory here against Manchester City after Valtz and Rykov's penalty had cancelled out O'Reilly's opener in the first...